Well, you know, the spaghetti sauce is getting a little old. Maybe, yeah, oh, that salsa is pretty old too. Uh, that's pretty old butter. I probably should get rid of that. Um, yeah, that's, oh, this jelly is probably pretty old too. Get rid of that too. Oh yeah, and the uh, Smart Balance looks like it could be going in the old recycle. There we go. Good. Good morning, it's Deka Johns, Blue Water Vicariate School's video of the day. As you can tell, it's National Clean Out Your Refrigerator Day, America Recycle Day, and it's also I Love to Write Day. So if you do love to write, it's a good time to write something. Maybe you'll write your own book or an essay or a story that you could share with somebody else. Everybody have a great day. Here's a look at this day in history. November 15th. On this day in 1777, the Second Continental Congress approved the Articles of Confederation, the precursor of the United States Constitution. In 1969, Dave Thomas opened the first Wendy's fast food restaurant in Columbus, Ohio. And on this day in 1867, Wall Street started ticking with Edward Callahan's new invention. The stock tip would telegraph current stock prices to brokerage houses across the country. It revolutionized the stock exchange by transmitting information in real time, and it made for great parades. And that's this day in history. Our saint of the day, day is St. Albert the Great. He is a renowned scholar and a pioneer in the field of natural science, keeping his own laboratory for scientific experiments. He is known as one of the greatest thinkers of his day, called by his contemporaries, the teacher of everything there is to know, for writing an encyclopedia of all human knowledge up to that point in history. St. Albert the Great was one of the most famous preachers of his day and served as a papal theologian in Rome. He was declared a doctor of the church in 1931 by Pope Pius XI. We ask for St. Albert the Great to pray for us. Our verse of the day is from Hebrews. All these died in faith without having received the promises, but from a distance they saw and greeted them. They confessed that they were strangers and foreigners on the earth. Which means that our citizenship is in heaven, and when we get to heaven, we know that there's people of faith from all over the world that we don't know yet. But when we greet them in heaven, we'll all be brothers and sisters under God's kingdom. And our joke of the day, what do you call a fish with no eye? A fish. Everybody have a great day.